When we get racist abuse after a football match at the end of a tournament, I expect it, unfortunately, because it exists and it's actually promoted by the Prime Minister who called Muslim women letterboxes. They said they look like letterboxes. So, honestly, we've got, to, we've got to do something about this. I keep saying it on television. I keep getting accused of having a go at the Conservative Party. It's nothing to do with Conservative or Labour or Liberal Democrat. It's to do with integrity. It's to do with doing the right thing. So, you know, it, it gets me wound up that we're surprised and we're talking about... Of course, I knew the minute that uh, Bukaya Saka Rashford and Sancho missed last night. I knew we would be waking up this morning to headlines of racist abuse. And I've, I've already said sorry for any offence that I've caused, and I say it again. But, but let me be very clear that uh, I don't set out to cause offence in, in what I've written. Mm. I think what people want to know is what are we going to do now? Yeah, no, what What's people want to know, if you're going to be Prime Minister, why would you say something like that? Well, I think, you, you know, you, it's always worth looking at what the whole article says and what I'm really intending to say, uh, because actually it's quite, quite the opposite. And, you know, I'm very proud of, of, of you know, uh, my record on uh, combating extremism and, of, indeed, of my Muslim ancestry. <laughs> Api tak main, hantar dah makan latihan.